So I just spent a couple hours uh, throwing blankets, every blanket that I had in the house, throwing it over all the plants outside, trying to salvage what I can. You know, I live in, in the Texas Hill Country, so many of the, the plants that I have are not very cold tolerant. They're more like Mediterranean. And she grabbed this from the laundry room while I was playing. I mean, sorry, while I was working. She was playing. Look at her. A oh, little destructive self. Lucia. So I have to be very, very careful that she doesn't get too cold. Um, because she was actually, uh, you know, trying to oops, follow me outside and, you know, the big dogs were outside with me while I was working, but Lucia, you know, she started to shiver. So I had to quickly put her inside and close the doggy door so she didn't go out the doggy door to follow me. So, uh, yeah, these puppies, <laughs> they really do, um, freeze easily. They get cold very easily. And, oh, I wanted to tell you all this real quick. Hi, that's my baby. Uh, you know these little door stoppers, the, the little, uh, the cap on them? Um, she pulled this, she pulled the cap off and tried to, she had it in her mouth, so I had to pull it out of her mouth. But now I, I just take them off of all the little door stops because she'll try to pull those off and eat them. Um, but anyway, oh, it's been hectic. Ah, see, hi, Papa. Ooh. I don't know if he's feeling sick or not, but it's been kind of hectic. Um, okay. I got their chicken boiling. Well, I will show you the work I did. There's my plumeria tree. Oh, Lordy. Every blanket in the house looks like a ghost town out here. Every single blanket. I've got, you know, I spent a lot of hard work on this garden. <laughs> Check that out. <laughs> oh, Lordy. And I, I ordered these off Amazon. You know, I don't know how... They're supposed to prevent uh, frost, but I don't know how well they're going to work, but we'll see. Uh, so yeah. I want to show you the sign that my friend from work got me. It's pretty cool. Yeah. What's that? Ah, Z. Come on, Papa. Come on out, sir. Come on out, Come on. Yeah, see, he... He doesn't like it when I, when I'm out here on my own. They're very protective. They want to be by you all the time. Uh, they're just so instinctively, you know, just protective. They get real worried. I would tell you something like last night, was it last night? One of these nights, I didn't get home till nearly midnight. Uh, I went into work and had to fix some stuff up. I live an hour from my work, and anyways, uh, I, it was cold, you know, but he stayed outside. Uh, he stayed outside the entire time because I saw him on the, on the dog camera that I have outside. I got surveillance cameras all over my property, and, I, and so I can watch what they're doing, but, but yeah, close this gate. Um, he usually doesn't stay outside that long. Sorry, I know it's dark out here. Get back in here. But yeah, he doesn't, he usually does not stay outside that long. Um, he stayed, literally stayed outside at the gate looking for me, um, until midnight. He didn't go back inside once. So, that's a kind of corso for you. They, they, uh, they worry about you. They want to make sure you're protected. Um, and it's not, I don't think it's so much separation anxiety. Um, 
as it is, they, they want to be by your side to protect you. I think that's a lot to do with it as well. So yeah, I got their chicken boiling. I just want to check in with everybody, say hi, and uh, I hope everybody's staying warm. And I hope everybody is has got heat, is not gonna freeze. I know <laughs> my backup for the backup for the backup plan is these dogs put out a lot of body heat. So if all else uh, fails, I got I got my walk-in heaters right here to keep me warm. And I do have this wood burning fireplace, you know, that uh, I could just throw some logs in there. But yeah, hope everybody stays warm. And um, we'll ride out this uh, Arctic blast. I know you, you guys in the north and the east. Come on, guys. Got it way worse than we do here in Texas. Gonna get in the teens in Texas, um, so we're not used to this kind of weather. But could be worse. Could be worse. I know. Anyway, we'll talk at y'all uh, later, and hope y'all having a good night. Say bye, guys. Say bye, Papa. <laughs> bye, y'all. <laughs>